Hi! Welcome back to my channel. Ipagpatuloy natin ang ating review sa civil service exam at ang itatakol natin ay ang uh, para sa iba ay mahirap na subject sa civil service exam ang numerical reasoning questions tara na Itatakong natin ngayon ay ang numerical reasoning questions na dating lumabas sa civil service exam. Ito kasing mga math questions or numerical reasoning questions ay maraming nahirapan sa mga questions na ito sa sa mga examinees sa civil service exam kasi hindi naman lahat ay magagaling sa math kaya nahirapan nahirapan sila pero siguro kung practice lang tayo ng practice ay makukuha din natin ang ang mga kung paano sa, sasagutin ang mga questions na ito so ngayon And dito tayo sa numerical reasoning questions. I will try my best na ma-explain kung mabuti kung paano natin sasagutin ang mga ito. Directions. Itong mga questions na ito uh, ay dating lumabas sa civil service exam. At hindi na hindi natin ano, malitin itong mga questions na ito. Kasi mga tricky ito at Uh, kung malilito tayo, hindi na tayo makasagot ng mabuti. At na-observe ko sa mga, kasi pinag ko mga ratings yung pinupost doon sa mga, sa mga groups ng civil service exam. Na-notice ko na mas malaki ang weight sa math or sa numerical reasoning na test. Kasi di ba Uh, broken down yun, my verbal, uh, analogy, numerical reasoning, general information. Na-notice ko kasi, may isang, may isang review ako na average na pumasa sa exam, sa mga pumasa, uh, may isang review na pumasa, average lang siya sa verbal, average lang siya sa logic, average lang siya sa sa general information pero above average siya sa numerical reasoning mas malaki ang rating niya doon isa lang ang above, above average siya ha? numerical reasoning lang mas malaki ang rating nila yung mga ganon ganon ang result sa rating mas malalaki ang rating rating nila kaysa doon sa mga nakapasa sa exam na above average sila sa verbal ability, above average sila sa logical reasoning, above average sila sa general info, pero average lang sila sa numerical reasoning. Mas malaki ang nakuha yung average lang lahat except sa numerical reasoning na above average. Mas malaking nakuha niya. Then marami akong Mar marami akong inoobserve na ratings ganun din ang nangyayari kaya inisip ko malaking weight itong numerical reasoning kaya nakapag-decide ako na ito ang itatakol ko ngayon sa succeeding na videos ko para makahelp na lang sa magtitake ng exam sa perhaps sa civil exam, service exam ngayong March 2023 or yung mga magtitake ng computer exam sa civil service baka ma maka help ako at saka ito kasi numerical reasoning ay very tricky question um, very tricky questions kasi kung minsan uh, malilito sa tayo sa mga data na given kaya kailangan brush up tayo sa basic arithmetic 
addition, subtraction, practice, practice tayo, division, at saka multiplication. So, let's go to the question. Hindi ko na binago ang numbering ha. Ito ang numbering niya nung lumabas niya sa civil service exam. Number 116. The series starts with 2,187. Next is 729. Next is 243. Next is 81. Number series ito ha, 27, ang next din, 9. Ang choices are, 1, 6, 2, 3, uh, choice number 3 is 4, and choice number 4 is 2. Ano ang number series questions? Number series questions are based on numerical sequences that follow a logical rule pattern based on elementary arithmetic concepts. So, sinasabi na natin ang elementary arithmetic concepts, addition, subtraction, division, and multiplication. They follow some series to identify the missing number. Binibigay, bakit may number series? Binibigay ito sa mga exams to test our reasoning, to test our logic. Isa rin ito pag-determine kung magaling ba ang applicants nila or may uh, ability ba. They follow some series to identify the missing number. So ano ang missing number after 9? This question follow the arithmetic series kasi maraming series yung number series. Ito ay example sa arithmetic series. So... Uh, let's go to the answer. What is the answer? Notice that the numbers in the pattern are divisible by 3 to get the next number. Diba ang 9? Tingnan natin. Divisible by 3. 27 div divisible by 3. 81 divisible by 3. Therefore, you divide 2,187 by 3, you'll get 729, yung next number. 729 by 3, uh, it becomes 243. Then the next number, and so on. So, if you, you divide by 3, 9 by 3, you'll get 3. Question number 117. Is number series again. Again, this question, follow the arithmetic series pattern. Kung addition ba, subtraction ba, division ba, or multiplication. Number 117, the number series is 1, next is 4, 9, 16, 25, 36, 49, 64 and what is the missing number the choices are there are four choices the choices are 72 75 81 and 90 so uh, let's examine the series number uh, of this 117. Notice that the next um, number in the series is determined by adding the next add number added to the previous number in the series. So adding add number added to the previous number in the series. So, uh, let's check. To illustrate, the first number in the series is 1. 1. The next number is... Or... Rather, the next number, add number after 1 is 3. 
So, 1 plus 3 is 4. So, ang next number sa series after 1 is 4. The next add number after 3 is 1, 3, 5. Diba ang add number? 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11. Ganon ang add number. The next add number after 3 is 5. So, 4 plus 5 is 9. So, the next number to 4 is 9. And then, after 5, the next add number is 7. So, 9 plus 7 is 16. Then, the next add number to 7 is 9. 9 plus 16 is 25. Nakita natin. The next na add number to 9 is 11. So, 11 plus 25 is 36. Then, the next add number to 11 is 13. So, 36 plus 49 is... How... Uh, no, no, no. Sorry. Uh, the next add number... To 11 is 13. So 36 plus 13 is 49. The next add number to 13 is 15. So 49 plus 15 is 64. So after 15, what is the next add number? It is 17. So 64 plus 17 equals 81. So the correct answer is 81. So yung dalawang number series questions lang muna ang itatakaw natin para mag-grasp ninyong mabuti kasi mahirap itong math kung hindi ninyo uh, maintindihan masyado kung paano sasagutin ang, ang questions. So, uh, sa sinasabi ko na, practice, practice, practice and brush up with your basic arithmetic na Addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. Para masagot natin ang mga number series questions. So, bye for now. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to click like, subscribe, and the notification bell to be, to be updated sa mga succeeding uploads ko. Don't also forget to like my page just cool names kasi doon ay nagpo-post ako ng mga practice sets na pwede nyo yung mga practice kasi kailangan talaga sa civil service exam na practice 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 and practice also the shading so bye for now thank you thank you very much to everyone keep safe everyone love you all